Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Food Outlaws with me as always, my brother and of course our normal guest, Hunter. Today we got a little challenge video we're gonna do. We've got uh, Elijah's extreme uh, father and son handcrafted reaper sauce. It's got four out of five flames on the bottle here. I'm not gonna go into uh, all the ingredients like I normally do. Basically the hot stuff's the Carolina Reaper, but this is an award-winning sauce. In this bowl, we've got some meatballs, barbecued meatballs just made, taken out of the crock pot. I'm gonna pour almost the entirety of this bottle in here. Shake it up, we're gonna have five meatballs a piece and we're just gonna try to eat those drenched in the reaper sauce. Yeah, I'll let you open it. I'm probably gonna get the uh, rubs on just the way you run, don't touch my eyes. Yeah, we're gonna use the toothpicks to eat them with. Might use the toothpicks, but I'll pick the meatballs on the toothpicks. Alright, here we go, we're in business. Give it a little shake here. Alright, let's see how much that is. Yeah, about a third of the bottom left. That'll suffice. Well, you can smell right through it. You know it smells like chocolate sweet. Yeah, I don't know what it is like. I don't either. It's Reaper Meatball. <laughs> Extreme, right? Yeah, it's only four out of five though, so who knows? We will see. It's either gonna be really hot, taste nasty, or both good and taste good and have good heat. Or... It'll probably have good heat. I don't know if it's gonna taste good or not. Alright, no time limit or anything. Just see if we can eat all five. Hmm. No, it's the heat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, not really that hot yet. Mm. It actually kind of works with this barbecue flavor. I'm not, not having any heat. Huh? <clears throat> I'm getting a little now after I swallowed my second one. I feel like mild. I mean, you can taste it, taste the hot sauce. But it's not. Yeah, it actually tastes good with this barbecue. I'll be honest, it's good. It is. And we use quite a bit of the bottle. Yeah, it's got just the right amount of heat for me. Yeah, I mean, you can taste it. It's more of a, it's, you know, longer you eat, more you eat, hotter it gets, but I'm not having any heat. Me either. I'm not really. I have to get a one for heat, even though it says 405. That's got a really good taste. Oh, I love it's it. worth eating. The taste is great. You can put it on, on you know, honestly anything. It's not going to burn your mouth up. It's not going to be unenjoyable. It's honestly one of the greatest hot sauces I've ever tasted. Yeah, that's the only place I've really got any heat is on my tongue and a little on my lips. Me too. Yeah, that. Really nothing. But yeah, it's uh, Elijah's Extreme uh, Handcrafted Reaper Sauce, and it tastes great. 
It's worth buying, so if you want to get yourself some good hot sauce that ain't hot, it's got great taste, that's for you. Yeah, I'd probably give it a five. Honestly, like on a scale of like taste and just obviously the basis of a hot sauce has to be a 10 out of 10. It's sweet, it's tasty, it has heat, but not too much heat for the average person, so. Yeah, I can see why it says it won an award. It deserves an award for the yeah, taste. It really does. It went real, real well with the meatballs. I'll probably give some meatloaf, a hamburger. Oh, I'd say yeah, anything great. like that. Any barbecue dish, definitely. Hey, man, that's great. Well, as far as that goes, we're going to go ahead and end this video here. We've got uh, more new products on the shelf and uh, more videos coming your way. So stick around for the next one. See ya. See ya.